What's up people? I'm back. It's been a while but yeah this time around I've got a really uh, good thing for you. I've got a custom ROM review. Uh, it's been you know I, uh, three days since I rooted my Galaxy Note and I decided to root uh, my Galaxy Note and you know go ahead with a custom ROM, flash it with a custom ROM because uh, I, I was, I'm tired of waiting for something to release ICS. You know it's been a while and they have now posted it on to Quarter 2. So hell you know by the time they're out with an, uh, they're, uh, with an ICS ROM I'll be running. Jelly bean. I mean, come on, man. So um, that's why, and you know, it's 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 far better, anyways, because uh, the Samsung's ICS is gonna be loaded with TouchWiz, anyways. So that's why I decided to go ahead and flash a custom ROM. So what I've done is I've uh, flashed uh, ICS Tunner and uh, that uh, 4.3 version. Yeah, and I've been using it um, for three days. Uh, it's really good. It's really stable. You know, it's really fast. It's really. Um, it's super, it's super smooth and the battery life it's really good and uh, around 7 hours, 6-7 hours ago I flashed it to version 4.4 it's uh, had some bug fixes but you know I, although I didn't notice any in the version uh, earlier version 4.3 so let's get into this shit mm, there you go I'm using my mouse view you know oh, let's get the hell. so there you go now you can have a better look um, guys, um, this particular ROM is is called the ICS Stunner, and you know it does live up to its name. It's a stunner indeed. I mean, uh, it's it has no issues uh, whatsoever. I mean, uh, it has two, two only two cons as far as I have noticed. But you know, I'll be telling those to you in the end only. This uh, uh, particular ROM runs, you know, two UIs. Uh, this one is the tablet UI, and the other one is the phone UI. I'll be showing you both the UIs right right now it's uh, the tablet UI and I mean if you look at it it's uh, pretty much amazing you know everything is uh, the icons are really small you know I'm running the tablet mode and uh, there's uh, you don't have a notification bar on the top uh, the notification bar is down here if you can see um, let me pop this up there you go and uh, I mean people um, look at this I mean you have got all the dodgels here and you've got this brightness control there you go so yeah everything works fine uh, as far as I've noticed and um, let's pop into settings and show you guys the version you know uh, the best thing about this ROM is that you know look at this I um, mean your screen splits up into two parts you know where whatever you click here it's gonna be open up here if you go in about phone there you go this channel version 4.4 Android version is 4.0.3 and 7000 that's it so alright let's talk about the goodies you know uh, it, has, it is running that's my YouTube widget it's running uh, the Apex launcher uh, it's highly customizable you can customize it further by going here and you know all the good stuff is there I mean home screen store settings folder everything you get everything and these buttons work indeed this is the home this is the back button and this is the recent task button so yeah and uh, one thing more that you know I've been running this ROM for about you know three days or so I've been running the version 4.3 and I have noticed no no force closes whatsoever and you know the battery life is really good uh, I mean uh, I'll show you the battery life mm, there you go so yeah it's 95% and i am be using it for around 1 hour 22 minutes and yeah it, it, it's really good it's re I've issued you know I have no issues whatsoever so uh, these, this is your drawer there you go just uh, no fancy thing here just uh, ICS drawer so I've shown you then there's a notification bar I've already shown you that and this is your dialer there you go it looks amazing the logs and the contacts um, and one thing more that uh, what I've noticed is that you know the when you switch it to tablet mode it you know it doesn't you know all, uh, you know the only OS uh, shifts into tablet mode it's not not only the OS the ta the apps as well I mean if you go into let me show you something if you go into YouTube there you go so I'm running the tablet version of the YouTube so that's pretty much amazing guys because uh, if I you know click on something you know if I want to see your video there you go so it's running in tablet mode so that's really cool huh and if I switch it back to the phone mode 
the apps are gonna switch it switch back as well. So that's what I like the most, yeah. And then if I pop it here, there you are. So it's 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 really really amazing, you know. Uh, it's really awesome. So uh, I've been using, uh, you know, just hold on a sec, yeah. So I'll uh, show you some more goodies of this ROM uh, if you go into um, system settings. So it's highly customizable, guys. And if you see here, I've got a Euphoria control. And what this uh, Euphoria control does is these are the names of developers. Uh, the team passion is the the ROM developers, and you know, new buddy, I am. Thanks to you guys, cheers to you guys. Uh, this is an amazing ROM, and this is the best ICS ROM I've uh, come come across till now. So yeah, this is the best. So if you go into Euphoria controls, you can see the general UI. Here yeah, you have the option of switching the tablet and phone UIs, and you know it takes only a reboot to switch from tablet to uh, phone UI and vice versa. So it's uh, really cool, huh? And uh, navigation, lock screen, power menu options, everything you got here, weather and the state of our options and everything I mean everything so and there is a nice little tweak here yeah, if you pop in the performance uh, if you go to CPU so as you can see you can underclock your processor so if you, uh, you, uh, you can go to uh, like I mean um, uh, 1.4, 1.2 or something then it's really, uh, it's, uh, really you know, gonna increase your battery life you're gonna get more juice out of your battery and it might you know last uh, around one one and a half one and a half or two days I guess because right now I, as of now it, it lasts it does last uh, more than one day I mean it does last around 24 hours so uh, that's pretty much amazing you know I, I it's awesome uh, and uh, I, I told you earlier also that there's no issue whatsoever with this uh, with this ROM and uh, yeah so I started two weeks I have not enabled any and yeah I've, you know it's running 4.4 only I have not underclocked that yet it's running fine and that's pretty much it guys uh, if you go to you know even if you go to the your play store um, there you go mm, the play store yeah oh, oh my god oh my god uh, so there you go. If you uh, look at this, I mean, if you click uh, like this, master's start to call tournament. Uh, there you go. So the Play Store is also in tablet mode. That's all I wanted to show you guys. And yeah, this ROM is pretty fast. You know, it doesn't come with crappy touches or something. You know, it it it's awesome. All right, uh, and you know, uh, with ICS, you know, it comes uh, the Chrome browser compatibility. So yeah, you can run Chrome browser and it's really fast. Let's pop into gallery. Mm, there you go. This is how your gallery looks like, and it does support all the video playbacks. The camera is working fine. Uh, if I show you a camera, there you go. And let me. Oh, I can't. Can I click? No. Oh. So it does work, yeah. So the camera is working fine. Everything is working fine. So um, let's show you this the phone mode of this ROM. Mm, I'll go into system second settings, for your control, general UI, system tablet. You know, what you have to do is that you know uh, go into Euphoria controls, general UI, switch between this tablet and phone UI, and um, hey, you just have to you know clear market data and change your density to. Right now, I'm running. 213 213 that's your tablet uh, dpi and if you pop into you know uh, if you want to go back to the phone mode go to 320 and just do a reboot and it will you know start up in uh, phone mode let's go ahead and do that so while it's been re uh, while it's rebooting guys uh, one thing i want to point out that you know i really i strongly recommend that you go ahead and root your phones cuz you know it's going to be faster smoother and you know you, it's going to look great i mean uh, it's my phone I, I mean what the heck i i, I paid for it and you know i i don't want to uh, uh, i don't want to you know uh, wait for Samsung to go ahead and re release touch wheels for it or oh, it's, yeah it's working fine huh? uh, i i don't want to uh, you know, it's uh, my phone, and I, I, I should be the one calling the shots here, not Samsung. So yeah, it's I don't want to wait. 
I mean, I told you earlier that by the time they are out with ice cream sandwich, I, uh, hell, I'll be running uh, uh, jelly bean because Google is going to be out with jelly bean, I think, in July end or something. So go ahead, uh, root your ROM, uh, root your phone, sorry, and you know, you're going to get, you know, everything is going to be amazing because uh, you won't have that crappy touch base. It's pure ICS experience and it's not running anything on it. And it just takes, you know, some. Uh, once you root your phone, it's gonna take around, you know, 20 minutes or so to root your uh, to switch ROMs. I mean, uh, uh, around five, so five, ten minutes to go and it rest pack up your data and restore it, and uh, another 10 minutes for. Mm -hmm. There you go. It's starting up. It's not started up yet. It's scanning or something. So this is the phone mode, guys. This is the phone UI. If I go, this is your oh crap, get out of here. Uh, this is your uh, all the dolls here, and you know the brightness. It does work. There you go. Oh my gosh. So yeah, I've I've, uh, I've shown you the phone mode. Let's go into YouTube. So the apps are also back in you know the phone mode. How cool is that? There you go. I showed you the tab mode earlier and this is the phone mode and you know the YouTube is back in phone mode and hell even the play store so this is pretty good ROM I mean this is pretty stable no force closes no issues I'm running the 4.4 uh, 4 .4 version you go ahead and you know directly flash 4.4 on it I came up from 4.3 from uh, to 4.4 but yeah it's a pretty good ROM guys uh, go ahead and root your phone now the cons you know, once you flash your ROM, this ROM, this particular ROM, it's gonna render this useless. You know, uh, you won't be able to use your S Pen. I mean, uh, you won't, you don't have S Memo, you don't have S Planner here. And if you see, I can't take a screenshot. Nope, nothing. So you won't be able to edit your screenshots. You won't be able to edit your pics with the S Pen. So it's gonna it's gonna render this useless, but what the hell? Yeah, I'm using this for you know three four months, and I've been using S Pen, so I'm okay with that. And it does come with something like Free Note and Super Note. Mm -hmm. Where did it go? Oh, oh oh my gosh, there's no Free Note or oh, Super Note. It was in 4.3. You can download it from market anyways, and there is no Free Note either. I guess nope. Uh, I've been running with for the six hours, so I didn't notice that. So uh, yeah, guys, uh, it's gonna render this useless. And the second thing, it do, but it does work in SuperNote and FreeNote. You can take down notes from uh, your S Pen. And the second thing, uh, it's gonna you know it doesn't offer as uh, the, your USB connectivity. I mean, I've got my mouse connected. There you go. I've been using it, but uh, you won't be able to connect a pen drive or an external USB. You won't be able to do that as of now. Maybe in the 4.5 update. And maybe in the next updates you can use uh, uh, your S Pen apps as well. So that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, uh, this is the custom uh, ROM review, the ICS Tanner. And uh, I'll be back with some more custom ROMs on, once I uh, go find any any good uh, better than this one. And there will be once uh, the uh, official ROM is out. And you know, if you like my video, and importantly, if you like the ROM hit like and subscribe guys because uh, I'll be back with some more ROMs I'll be back with some app reviews and I've ordered an SGP case ultra thin, SGP ultra thin for my galaxy node and it's on its way so once I get my hands on that I'll be uh, reviewing that as well so that's it guys uh, that's pretty much it I'm signing off and I'll be back with some more goodies don't forget to hit subscribe because you know I've been uh, I've been, you know, really putting it everything into my videos, and I am doing it for you guys only. And uh, yeah, hell, you know, I, I I didn't want to root my phone. I root it for you for the sake of you guys, cause so you can have a look at it. And uh, I hell, hell even I bought my Galaxy Note for you guys only. Oh, that I hope that crap. Yeah. Now oh, it's late. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, okay. oh my God. It's 12:50. I have to order my pizza, I'm out. Yeah, you guys go ahead and flash your ROMs and, you know, uh, flash your ROMs on your Galaxy Note or break it trying. But I'm out. Yeah, cheers guys. Take care. Happy rooting. Bye-bye.